Good morning. Good morning. We are beginning Hilke Shechita today. And we are going to uh, learn some halachas in the beginning and also from Perry Dalid um, and get to understand the Rambam opinion regarding Shechita. What Shechita is, some very interesting points here. So, just to note that there is a debate whether Shechita is a mitzvah because perhaps it's not. It's just a means to be able to eat something. Nobody has to eat meat. In fact, uh, there's a world out there that uh, and doesn't believe in eating meat, right? And vegetarians, they don't want to eat meat. Yet, or, so why would it be a mitzvah? But the Rambam holds it's a mitzvah. And the Ravid argues on him, not here, but in the, um, I believe it's in the Minyan mitzvahs, earlier on in the, in, in, in the Sefer, where the Rambam brings the halacha, the lishchet chayev, brings the mitzvah, lishchet behemer chayev aif, kachech v'sarem. So the Rambam says, the only time, ule lava bamek lala say, I say, that's the most you can say, it's, it's because it's a lava bamek lala say, because it doesn't let you eat it unless it's, uh, <clears throat> just to note, in Sefer mitzvahs, the Rambam brings, the one lishchet, and only shechita. Leilam hepta el b'shechita lavav. What does he mean with that? What's he trying to say with that? Okay, we get to that. So he said, "Mitzvahs esse ramen perik alav halachal." Mitzvahs esse she yishchid mi she yirtz alachu basal behima chayiv aiv achkach yechus. She never was a vachtam et karcha et And then he brings the pasuk when never be pcher b'amum. And then it means an eye for eye. Says, Okay, that's a loch. A loch is a loch that sounds very interesting, but we're not going to get into every part of the halacha. We'll just touch on it. They're all one day. The Fichach, Asheich, Beheim, Aichai, Aif, Orach, Kila, Shich, and Zaisan, Alach, Shit. What he wants with that, we'll see. But the next line is a cappella. In Leib Birch, Beheim, 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 clearly even Shegig. Habasamutter. In other words, he is being Shailo. Negating a thought that without a bracha, the, 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 it wouldn't be good. Now, some want to say that the reason there would be a sir without a bracha it shouldn't be good is because it's, uh, if it were amazing, you'd become a mummer, maybe. It's just a chiddish pella. <clears throat> but the Ramam Kali says it's shaking also. So it can't mean that. So what is the Ramam? What is he coming to? To, to preclude? What is he coming to? Okay. Perik Dalid, Alochi Yud Zayin, the Amor writes, and Kishahu Yisrael by Midbar. And this is the Amor gets into history. Lein Istavu B'Shchitas Hachul. They did not have a mitzvah Shchita and Chul. Elohi Neichu Neishechu Neichu Tsharim. They would just kill an animal. Neichu or Shechita, and they would eat Kishar Haumus. Like all the going. Ah, then in the midbar, that means after Mount Tyre. The Stab of Midbar, but in the midbar they were told, which is partial sort of a color it's a lishkid lishkid al Islam, which never is issue based on she's got shirt, that's how I made mana she view. So if she's a slum in my sham, you want a shah, gotta bring, gotta bring a slum. This is the Rambam's interpretation. As we'll see, the Gemara does not say this. 
אבל הרי צל לינכר ולכר במדבר היינך. And now, the Ramah seems to say that there, in the in the midbar there went a separation. Shlamim, Shchita, Chulan, Nechira, which is again not this doesn't say anything. And Allah Yud Ches, Ramah continues, Umitz Vizu in the Heges Leis of Midbar Vad the Eis Eter and Nechira. This mitzvah, meaning pastus, the mitzvah of 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 zvicha shlomim only, only happens in the midbar. Bish is eter on the chira. What what does this mean? Eter on the chira. Then it's tabusha. Shachir is a liar. It's the on the chira. I mean, he should have just skipped to this. <laughs> that way, that that they in the midbar they were told he cut the root. No more nechira. Only shchit. What, 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 what's the first introduction? Yishchid of Chol Makom Ma'elam Chutz Lazar. You can check it out. So Lazar Shnei Kiyach of Avayis Gulcha Zavachta Mibkorcha. Sayin Chashenas Nashem Lakechel. Zui Amitzur Neig Zadarius Lishchit Vachakachech. This is the mitzvah Lishchit Vachakachech. In other words, this comes full circle. It seems. This is what I said in the beginning. Oh, 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 what, what, he said it already. Oh, I'll just repeat it here. Um, so we already stressed some points. What's the Lashen in, in Seif HaMitzvah? Lilam at the El Bishchita. Until now, that's all there was a head to wrestle. He, he could kill. There was no heel. And then the question is, why did I have something going to history? Who cares? So there are different answers given as to why we care. Those who say that it's negated to certain shailas, a certain halachas, and that, that the, knowing this helps us understand different things. There, there's a lot of explanations, but we're not going to get into that. We don't have to talk about that. Okay. So <clears throat> now, where, where does this where, where does drama originate? So Gemara Chol, Tazayin, Yudzayin, the Machlekes of Bishmol and Rabbi Kim. What when it says in the post the Kiyach of Hashem al Keches Bul Chashdi al Achmat Oich Lamasa? So Bishmol says, what is the post telling me? It's coming to tell you that from now on you can eat Basar Taiva, you can eat regular meat. So he explains, During the Midbar, they could not eat regular meat. The only meat they can eat is shlom. Ah, you would think, now that we're going, maybe now it's back. No, 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 uh, so it says, no, you continue shkita. Rekiva says different. Rekiva says, It's a different bossing. Which again is a passion to eight. A less embossing. Okay. Bossing is coming to tell you, No more bossing here. Three little embossing here. Next slide. That's the embossing here. Came in that's a straw. Bossing here became awesome. So what are you arguing? And listen to this. Akiva says, it was never a Yisrael. Shmuel says, it was never a Hatam. <laughs> At once, there was a Tyre again. And then it goes through the So Mary asks a question, and it says, when Moshe Rabbeinu said, um, no, sorry. The Bishlam Chaim that says the Shachar is Ben Abaka. He says because Kachim. The answer is that yeah, because by Kachim there is Shchita. So now the Gemara goes to when Moshe Rabbeinu said Atzayin Abaka Yishachit Lam. Why does it say by according to Bekiva? Why does it say Atzayin Abaka Yishachit Lam? Yinochal Lam. So the Gemara answers in the Chiras Shulam Zuhi Shchitas. That's called Shchita. That was their Shchita. All right. 
Now, Magnisha stresses that the Ramam holds like a Rakim. I just am a Chalik. That's not a Rakim. But again, why? 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 Who's the gay? <clears throat> so the Radva says an interesting point that the reason he had to say this, he shouldn't say that since Nahir is Mutter and Mizarach is Kotchim, so Shrit is Midrabana. That's why he says, no. It was already told them that there's going to be a mitzvah. So the Chari is answering, why do we have to say the story? But it still needs a beer. Don't tell us the, the story and just say what you said in the beginning, that it's a mitzvah. Finish. Why do you have to get into the, the, the discussion? Um, just an interesting Gemara. Where has a shy? Boy, you're going to be here, Mia. They, uh, somebody killed an animal in the midbar and peered meat, barbecued it, whatever he did, put it into a silver foil <laughs> or whatever else to preserve it. I walked across the Jordan River, the rib, the yard, and, and now is in Eretz Yisrael. Can he eat this meat? Can he eat this meat? So the wire says, what are you talking when? The wire says, yeah, no way. And there was also a discussion. The says, a shy of the quadrant of Kiva. Before it was mutter, but now that it's an extra strong, maybe it's also. And what's in the area? <laughs> As he says, he got another truth. Lama the lambs. <laughs> Even though it's history. The rest says, that can't be. It just says, you have to try to understand what the shy is. Comes up with a different shot. Others give a third shot that it's negated to. If you know the child, what it is, it might be negated to uh, to, 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 to different halachas. What's the swaras going back and forth? Which we'll talk about what I think might be the swaras going back and forth. All right. So let, let, let's analyze the Rambam again and try to understand what's going on. And with that, uh, the Raivid there, as we said, asks on the Rama. There's no mitzvah shkita. Where did Rama get this mitzvah shkita? We know the Radvaz is the answer, but it's, 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 a, it's a problem with the Loshna Rama. Yeah. Okay, so question number one. Why does the Rama say that we ate Neichri Meshechten when they were in the Midbar Kishara Umus, like the other guy. Why, why, why do you have to compare us to that? <laughs> the main thing you say, who cares about Kishara Umus? So he says that in the beginning, you either did Neichrim or Sheikh. And then he says, that whoever wants to Sheikh, whoever wants to Sheikh, only can Sheikh Shlomo. But it wants to be Neichr, can eat here in the middle. And the shit is only in culture. That's a Hiddish spell for himself. There's no, there's no, there's no shit of Bachul. If I can't, the Raman seems to say that shit of Bachul would be a problem. So many tries to, uh, the people deal with it, but what's that? Yeah. And then we ask the question why does he have to say mitzvahs when you like the there? So you just say that when, when, when you go to Israel, you, 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 can, you, you go back to shit and no, no, the Hira. Yeah. And then he ends up, this is the mitzvah of Shita. <laughs> we know the mitzvah of Shita. He started off. What, 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 what's, 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 what's the purpose of that? So, Ulai, perhaps. This is the key. The Rambam has come full circle. He started off making a statement. There's a mitzvah to Shach. He ended up, he ends up saying, proving it. Here in Allah in Perik Dalit is the end of Perik Dalit. In other words, here is where he finally sets up and tells us how come he argues on the right. 
Why does he hold there is a Mr. Shvita? Why is it not just an optional thing if you want to eat? You know, I don't want to, I want to eat meat. I'm going to shake. Why is that a bit? So I think this, this is, makes a lot of sense if you read the Rama. And understand this, we have to realize the following. The Rama sets up three different stages of Klal Yisrael. There was Klal Yisrael in the Midbar where there was no chiyuv, no halachas. They ate meat if they wanted to eat meat. Kisha or humas. There was no chiyuv, there was no chiyuv to just kill it. Just make sure it's not alive. Not even in a high. And that's why he stresses his kishar He wants to tell you there was no din. There was no, no din in the shkit. No din in the mechir. Nothing. You just got to make sure it's not alive. Take away the din neighbor mechai, which was said to B'nai Neyach also. So you're eating kishar And he says that in order to come to the next level. Shlav Beis. The Ebishter told us I want, I'm giving you shechita. Giving you a shechita. Shechita is only my kutch. Shlom. Yeah, to us, shlom. Want to eat meat? It's got to be shlom. You want to eat chulim? You do nechira. But nechira now is something different. The Ramam learns this this is their this is their shita. And that's the Ramam learns that it's only shita, only Nikhira, because he is a little kiva, Maya Saiman Baki Shachan Lahem, you know, let me buy lay, right? Should have said, Why? If you can do shita, just say shachan lam also. The answer is you can't do shita on on the khul. So therefore. The Gemara asks, what's the loss of Yishach in that? And what's the Gemara's answer? Nechira zu Yishchitas. Nechira is a din shchita. In the Midbar, they, 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 we created, they actually created a new heter. Just like shchita is a matir, nechira was their matir. So according, at this stage, in Shlav Beis of, of, of the Midbar, there was a difference between Kotchen and Chulun. Kachin requires shchita, and chum it requires um, it requires nechira. Uh, now I want to take a second. The Rebbe in per in in Chelik Dalit the Sichas. Rebbe explains. Rebbe explains that. Um, that this is what the Rambam says that in the midbar there was only bus and the Khira given what the why because it's not shy he says I'm ready to give it. he says listen to this line because it wouldn't be shita would not work shita would not work shita would not work why because what is shita do Shita is taking it from wealth and putting it into holiness. And therefore, in the midbar, you could do that. But by regular chulin, you couldn't do that. And he says, if you would do it, the shita from Basar Taive would be like shita's chulin bazara. Ah. Only when they came to a higher level, when they went Knitz Laaret, only then was it fire to say such a thing. Only then could you um, could you say that they were able to uh, to, to, to eat to, to, to do to do shkita also. Uh, very matim with what we're saying. So I want to go now be based on the Rebbe's word that it would have been considered chulam bazara, and perhaps we can explain that here too. What happened to Shlav Gimel? 
שלב ג' זה גרמב״ם, דאט מנצטבו שם, שיחססו לארץ, תיאס הנחילה ויחלו כל מלא בשחית. וישחטו בכל מקום לאילם חוץ לעזור. זאת דרמם, this is not חולם בעזור, because it's, you're in a level of culture. Our חולם is a level of culture, has been elevated. Our חולם is in a different level, therefore you can שחט it everywhere. Everywhere you have to do שחיטה, because you have to elevate everything through the שחיטה. שחיטה is, שחיטה has a כיח on the food. It's not regular eating. It's not נחיר anymore. It's not a heter of, it's, 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 a, it's, 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 a, it's 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 a, That same koyach that, 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 that Shlomim had, that you only had an ability to do in Shlomim, now you can do in Chol. Oh, so now we, this is all coming to the last line. Bezu hi ha mitzvah nehegev nerz, lishchit vachachet. Which is why it's a mitzvah. Because it's not just letting us eat. It's the old shchitas chul, the kachim coming into chulim. Whatever Shkita's Kachim does now, you do it in Chulun. And Shkita's Kachim is definitely a mitzvah. It's, it, 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 it's not just the idea of eating, giving us a right to eat. It's, we had a right to eat before. It gave us a new way of eating, a new level of eating. An eating of Shkita. I think it's beautiful the way that Amman just takes us step by step. And that's why he tells us the history so to get to the understanding of why, what the mitzvah Shkita really is. Bezuhi, now you know that the mitzvah shchita. Not only is it, uh, is it coming full circle, it is giving us the understanding why shchita is a mitzvah. And that's what he means in Seif HaMitzvah, Shalai Yehei Lohan Heta El B'Shchita Lavad. The only thing that can give us now ability to eat is through a mice shchita, which is an act of kachim. This act of kachim now works for Chulm. Not that the Chulm has been elevated, but the act of kachim is now a Chulm. It works for Chulm. Now, perhaps, perhaps, since we're dealing with some spiritual elevation of the food or through the Maisa Shrita, some kind of accomplishment of Kachim Shrita, there is room that Amman believes to say that if I don't make a bracha, there's something missing. And my Shrita doesn't accomplish. The, 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 it's not a shrita with kachim aspects. And there is such a shrita, obviously, that I'm coming to, to uh, negate such a shrita. That's why the Raman comes along. The Raman comes along to tell us, don't think that here, because of this unique case, unique idea of a kachim, a nice kachim doing a chulim, it requires taka something more. It requires a brother. Now, even though the bracha is only the rabban, as Aaron says, but but this bracha is 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 part of the of the act. It comes to tell you no. Yeah, it needs more beer that last part, but I think uh, it, it could be understood. Okay, zayg zut neshtark, atzlocher rabba.